Hey, we're here at E3 and we're checking out a very cool new PC cooler. Um, what's the name of the company? Uh, we're Phononic, and this is our new, just launched this week at E3, uh, CPU cooler. We call it the Hex 2.0. The magic sauce here in our cooler is that we're a thermoelectrics company. It means we make thermoelectric devices or known as Peltier coolers. It lives down here in the base of the product. <clears throat> the top part of the product is a fan heat sink. You can see inside there's a fan, easy to replace fan with a normal header. The way the device works is we have our own firmware that's on board and it measures the temperature of the base plate. When the base plate starts to get hot based on the CPU stress, uh, it turns on the thermoelectric device. Power comes from the PCI uh, AUX graphics connector. We pull up to 35 watts from the for power, but it could be zero depending on the, the CPU stress. The fan is, uh, we provide a cable that uh, goes to your motherboard for the fan connector. The BIOS that you normally run runs the fan. We don't control the fan at all, just from your normal fan controls. If you hook up the USB connector, which also comes with a unit that goes to your motherboard, you can run uh, a Hex 2.0 dashboard that you can change the firmware settings, turn the thermometric on either earlier or later, and also change the color and or turn off the RGB LED that's in the, the cover here. Cool. So this is uh, selling right now on our website, phononic.com slash hex. Uh, it's also going to be on New Egg and Amazon by the end of the month, and units will start to ship very soon. So this is a good alternative to like a water cooling setup, it's a lot easier to kind of get started and installed or? That's right. So we benchmark ourselves against the smaller liquid coolers like uh, the single 120 uh, millimeter fan radiators and we see that we have equivalent if not better performance in some cases than the li small liquid coolers. So it's an ability to give a liquid cooling performance in a form factor that fits in many ITX systems. You know, we have two here in our booth at E3 We're showing 4790s and a 6700 overclocked to 4.5, 4.6 gigahertz. We can take all the TDP, one 80 to 200 watts of TDP and maintain your temperatures as if you had a liquid cooler in there. Cool. Thanks for showing off to us.